Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So life's slowly starting to pick back up from this whole corona thing. And while you're not seeing a lot of the rallies kick off because they're worried about the legalities, you're seeing a lot of other biker events kick off. One of those biker events, the poker run. Now if you're not familiar with what a poker run is, just about everybody's played poker, whether as a kid or as an adult, for cash or trail mix, whatever. You're given five cards. Out of those five cards, the person with the highest hand wins the prize, the pot. A poker run's pretty similar. You have roughly 50 to 100 mile ride. It's usually along some scenic area for your location. And then you're gonna have three to four different stops. Along each stop, you're gonna be given a card. When you get to back to your starting point, you're gonna get your final card. The person with the highest hand wins the pot. Now, what organizations are figuring out is it's a pretty easy money maker because most riders will pay 20, 25 to participate in this, then usually add 10 to 15 on for a passenger, and then they get to ride a lot. Well, each time they pick up a card, if they don't like their card, most organizations are giving them a chance to draw additional cards, of course, for a fee. So if I've got a pretty close hand, I'm gonna draw quite a few cards to try to get that better hand, that winning hand, if you will. And so I'll dump $5, $10, maybe even an additional 15 to get that extra card to get the better hand. And so you've got your set winning fee. Anything on top of that is just profit for the club or the organization. Now, yes, winning the money is a good thing, but as a poker run, if I'm gonna go, it's not because I'm trying to win a lot of money. If I want that, I'll go to a casino. I go to a poker run because I enjoy the ride or I'm helping the club or the cause. Got something different you wanna add to it? Put a link down below. Love to hear from you. Till next time, y'all be careful.